Hello everyone, this is Flying Dutchie and welcome back to Prussia, where we just birded the game. We saw a bird flying outside and suddenly the computer crashed. Oh, well, luckily for us, because we had some terrible things happening in the last episode. If you missed it, you need to check the end of the last episode, you will laugh your beep off. So, what happened? Friedrich Wilhelm I von Wittelsbach, yeah. It's the same dynasty as Denmark, Poland, Prussia, the Palatinate, and Landshut. Landshut, I guess, or Landshut. Landshut. On monarch death, succession war between Prussia and Poland. He is 71 years old. It can happen again. Now, if it happens again, I want to be out of this war. Because that is the only way... To fight Poland. And then we have to fight Poland. And yeah, there's just nothing we can do about it. Uh, but then we have to do something against Poland and Lithuania. And that's going to be very, very hard. So let's see if things will not go bad this time. I did not update my spreadsheet yet. I just want to go and record immediately. So I pause the game. Please don't die, Holstein. Or get an air. You need an air. Oh, you have to walk all the way like that? Uh, no. Well, yes, because we need to siege down this, so... Can I get military access from you? Oh, I can. Hello. No, we can't. No, we can't, because we need to siege that one first. Yeah. Of course we have access with everything. We are at war with the... No, we're not at war with the Emperor of Nassau, not Hesse. So... Holstein, get an air. Come on. Don't you dare to die. Don't you dare. To die. You cannot die. Do you hear me? Now, Nassau is only one province, so... We should siege it down and then we should be able to piece out everything. And prepare for an eventual war with Poland. Which is horrible. And also Austria did not join in. We have 75 trust. And he did not help me. Unbelievable. Uh, Saxony will hate me forever. Let's just not even try that anymore. Let's just go away. We completely siege you down so we can piece you out. And we will. We take your money. We can. We will not pillage your capital because that gives us aggressive expansion, and I don't want it. We will do this, and we need prestige. Make sure you don't get an alliance with Bohemia anymore. Do we care about the other ones? No. And he doesn't want to peace out anyway. Because his army is still running around. So we'll do something like this. No, I want his money. Never mind. Done. Done. Move back for... If it's gonna happen. Together with this. Siege out Nassau. Come on. Foreign quarter of Stettin. E3 can get relations. We make more goods. Or we get more trade power in Stettin. Oh, that's an easy uh, option, because now Stettin suddenly gets 59 trade power, which will increase our money to 11. So that uh, was a good thing to do. More money for Dutchie. Do you have an heir? Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, train a bit. Gonna piece you out. Take your money. Are you Protestant? No, now you are. And I also want your prestige, most likely. That's only 10. Let's get war operations. There we go. And now we're going to piece out Lüneburg as our vessel. It's next year. That will give us a little bit less because of expansion. It will cost a lot of Diplo power. 
but we are going to do this. I will not take your money because that will only slow you down. We to release Ferdan, get l uh, less stuff, but no, we want all the four provinces. And there we go. Lundeberg is now our vessel. Perfect. They are very unhappy though. To improve relations with them when we can. And now Holstein. Maybe we should just eat that province. I mean I still need a claim there. Let's just get a claim. Hopefully we can prevent something. But I don't know. Yeah, there will be people entering the coalition. Are you stuck? Um. 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 Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we did not annex the thing yet. <sighs> How do we get our army back? Well, Brunswick, do you want to give us military access? No. Of course not. Well, let's improve relations with him. Again. Our army is stuck. I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, and we need to improve with Lunenburg. We can take an idea. What can we take? We can finish quality ideas. Uh, absolutely. Our artillery is better. We have 5% discipline. And we can get the modern firearm techniques policy. This gives another 10% infantry combat ability. Absolutely. Now, when we finish economical ideas, we are going to get this one. Our army is pretty strong. Come home and improve. There comes the coalition again. How are we going to get out of this mess here? Well, our Dipper Reputation does do a little bit. Their opinion just needs to be zero. We could maybe give them a gift. Could give them a gift. Let's do this. And next subjects will go away in April. Yeah, we just give a small gift and then we are good to go. Well, maybe we will get uh, enough anyway. Um, have to do that one. Oh, it's in two years. Oh, shit. In two years we can get rid of it. We need to get rid of the Cologne military access, which I can't because we are stuck in there. I need to annex Magdeburg, which we can't do. This is horrible. This is so terrible. And there's not a lot I can do about it. 
Brandenburgian separatists. Yeah, people hate me because of our legitimacy and our prestige is so bad. It's not good at all. It is horrible. Anything I can do. Oh wait, they are not... Yes, there we go. I can do it. Uh, click, 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 click. Come on, come on, come on. Sit in Lübeck, I guess. There's a lot of supply limit there, so you can train. We'll ask you for military access. We will go back home. And then we are going to cancel it. Burgundy is now a great power, and we are not anymore. Rip. Cancel. Do you have an heir? Oh my god. Apparently we can finish one of our missions. Um, we can pick another thing here. Do we want... No, ship trade power can be nice. Yeah, let's go for the ship trade power. What can we complete? We can complete the balance of power. We are still considered as a great power, I think. Yeah, we are still a great power. But we are going to lose it in two years. And Burgundy is our rival and he became a great power. So I can complete the balance of power mission. Uh, power projection. Yeah, let's, let's get it. That was a tiny mission, but that's fine. Now, we have we are one over now, right? Yes, we just need to start integrating Magdeburg, which is going to be very hard to do. I want to marry this guy, but that's going to take some time as well. Let's get a little bit more here. How are we doing? Are we at 40%? No, not yet. We can click the button. I think I will. Or no. I need to cancel something so I can get the governing capacity, I think. Let's have a look. Do we want to keep the military power? Because all our rulers are going to get extra automatically. Uh, where is the, where where are the modifiers listed again? Yeah, here. Monarch military skill, plus three. So the plus one becomes a bit obsolete, right? Um. And there was this something we need to select for a mission. What was that again? Empower the Junkers. Junker Supremacy. Oh! We can get militarization automatically of 0 0.02. But all the power cost goes up. But I want this this thing, so we will have to pick uh, the Junker Supremacy at some point. After we did the Professional Army. So I will click this before I forget, I think. So no, we will not have the uh, governing capacity, unfortunately. But uh, let's click the button then. There we go. Building disaster, why? Yeah, but their loyalty goes up very soon. This is really annoying, the 100. It's really annoying. These rebels are gonna happen. Now, nah, just keep training until they spawn. I think we are strong enough. This guy hates me. Uh, 
Can we ask for money soon? Yes. But they have no money. I'm gonna offer and ask for military access to my two allies here. To keep their relations high. Because Holstein... Still not having an heir. Oh no! No, Holstein. Oh, we are at 99. We are not at 100 anymore. Holstein, why are you so annoying? I need I need a claim there. I need to declare war on them before stuff is gonna happen. I need to kill him. I need it. Cloth is worth more, wool less. Poor Turkey. Well, at least in Victoria too. Yeah, we certainly have some good church slots here. Now let's keep the money for the manufactories. And let's go to speed 4. Let's try to get to 50 army professionalism so we can do these uh, nice events in our mission tree. Now, I will get 4000 more troops, but those are 3 infantry. The horsey will get killed. But we can get 2 more. And we lost our advisor. The land maintenance modifier can be really powerful to make more money. And the other ones are just terrible. So I will pick him. This will make our army... Um, ...a lot cheaper. I will attack him at the end of the... ...month. But Austria is now on our side. Uh, we have to keep going. I have to fight... Poland. Well, there we go, guys. I need better advisors. Uh, what else can I do to increase my power? I can strengthen my military stuff here, but we are not that far. I think I'm gonna win though, because we are pretty strong with our infantry combat ability. Which technology do you have? 10. And just like me. So Poland, Lithuania versus Austria, Hungary and me. Yeah, we are gonna win that. We are gonna get a PU over Holstein. I don't like that one bit. Why do I want a PU on Holstein? Well, at least I can feed the land maybe to him. You'd start claiming stuff around here. Oh, I'm not. I'm not gonna re uh, do it again. I will. I will fight this war. I'm too late. I thought I was going to t attack them, so I will let them siege down Neubrandenburg, which will give them 10% local autonomy. RIP. Uh, we can continue our economical ideas, and that's fine, because we will get this one, more manpower and recruitment time. And our loans are cheaper. Yeah, people are combining at my very fine leader, and I think that leader is going to Poznan, or Posen in German. You're gonna take care of the rebels. You have enough morale to do it now. So we get a ticking war score because we have Holstein. And 
Nice modifiers. It's a bit scary over here. Did we just lose trust with him because of the war? No. I think we can ally Poland immediately again. But now they want all my provinces. So maybe we have to say goodbye to Poland and find someone else. Maybe Russia can help us or Muscovy. Um... They did improve with me. Let's try to get um, Muscovy on our side. That would be a good ally against Poland. Oh, the annexation is still not going. So we can stop this, actually. And improve with... Um, this is the coalition war. I still think I can win. I mean, I have all the money. I can hire mercenaries. I think we are fine. But we have to focus. We should do one war at a time. They have so many troops, it's so annoying. Do we have a good general? Of course not. We need to piece out Poland. We can just white piece Poland. Then we will have our union. Twenty six thousand troops are coming. I need to stay a bit focused over here, I think, so I can reinforce in time. Should I just uh, hire mercenaries right now, just in case? Maybe just this one. You have a lot of good uh, modifiers. I'm gonna get you. Yeah, we will go over our force limit, I know. Let's get them over here. Oh, we are fighting the boats. Um, really? The Livonian Order joins. Uh, maybe quickly go home. Okay, let's focus. Do we care if we lose the fort here? A little bit. I think I have to move this way. Do we finally have good advisors? Yes, discipline. Okay. We have a decent amount of discipline now. And this 7000 stack is pretty scared over there. Yeah, they are running away because there is a battle happening. I should just take the next fort down and pluck. And put half of the troops out of there. Big, big battle over here. We have more morale and discipline and infantry combat ability, so this should be a win. 
and I'm very happy with uh, with Austria. They actually helped us again. So, well done. Looks like we lost the battle. That is very bad for the war score. Uh, the mercenaries. You guys. Could take this fight here. They are going to attack me in the woods, aren't they? Yeah. And then we should just go. Leave one troop there. Can I uh, reinforce? I can. And you guys need to move there as well. Actually, everything needs to move there. I think I will take the battle because they will have a minus penalty. And then we will try again. Are they going for it? No, they changed their minds. But there is another one coming. A 5 4 3 2. Ugh. You will be landlocked soon. And now we will reinforce. If only one minus penalty. More morale, more discipline. Flanking. They are going to reinforce. They will be too late, I think. Well, maybe they are in time. They are in time, but I'm going to reinforce. And they gave up. That's exactly what we need. We need to win those battles. Okay, we won. Now you guys can move back to there. And you can go to Dorbzin. You guys can combine actually. And fight that. Where are all my cannons? You are my cannon group. You need to go there. And you are my mercenaries. So stay here for a bit. How much are we losing? We're losing 22 ducats a month. That's a lot. Winter Siege. We lose... I guess we do that one. Oh shit. Repair. <sighs> Why Poland? What is Austria doing? Nothing? We need to get their capital, and then hopefully we can white piece them out. And then we have to focus on the other war. Do you finally want a marriage? No, you're still very cranky. All our prosperity down the drain. They are already sieging my capital. I guess that is what you get when you're playing... ...on very hard. Need these two forts and these two. But we cannot not let our capital fall down. Can we please hurry up? We have eight cannons here. I mean, come on. 
Walls breached. I could do an assault, but no, we don't have the manpower for that. We need that for what's coming. Austria and Hungary are so weak, it's it's unbelievable. I need to save my home territories. We don't have money, but I have to click this. It's too good. Oh, luckily we got Poznan. We have to uh, go after them. We have to go. We have to go. We have to save our souls. They siege down Lübeck already. They are running for their lives. Let's kill a couple of small stacks here. Come on, Poland, don't be... Don't, oh. I knew it! They run all the time away from my armies. It's so annoying. Okay, I think they changed their mind. There are so many troops over here. We need to get Poland out of this war first. Yeah, just take the loans, I don't care. Okay, and now we are gonna... Why did my game not pass? We are gonna do this here. Yes, they are attacking me. We lost somewhere. I have no idea where that was. Okay, we have a battle. Now, we are killing a lot more than they do, but they have so many more men, so we are going to lose that war. That battle, we are going to lose that one. Uh, can I still bird the game? Maybe. This is this is it. We are we are gonna lose all of our, all of our troops, and we lose the, this war and that war. I am going to bird the game again, and I will be back to you guys uh, with a state, hopefully before this war and otherwise in this war. And then we are gonna peace out uh, Poland first, and then we are gonna focus on the coalition war this is going to be uh, very hard I think but uh, let's see how this will go so thanks for watching thanks for all your support and I hope to see you in the next video bye bye